Today, I'm going to discuss and show you how to do liver palpation during your clinical examination. Let us discuss the whole procedure first and then I will show you how to do it. First of all, let us consider this is a very important skill to know how to do a liver palpation during your clinical examination. This skill has number of micro skills in it, but we can subdivide these skills into major three groups. One is a preparatory group where there are about seven skills and then there are the actual palpation and then the closing. First group where the preparatory skills are needed, there you first do a greeting to the patient, you introduce yourself, you ensure privacy of the patient, proper illumination of that area where you are doing the job, attendant if and when necessary. This is the first group you consider. And then when you are going for the actual palpation, first counsel the patient, instruct how he is going to help you during your examination. For that, in case of liver, we will tell him to turn his face to the other side and keeping his mouth open, he will take deep inspirations. So, after doing that, you are supposed to sit beside the patient in a stool and looking towards the patient squarely so that you face him and see his face all the time. And then you should expose the patient properly and use the bed sheet down there to cover him properly and keep the whole examination in a modest way. After that, you are supposed to know that the position of the rectus, how broad it is. For that, if necessary, ask the patient to raise his hand without any support. You will find that rectus has uh, tightened up and you will feel the rectus outer margin, the lateral margin. And now you know that where to put your right hand. The next step is put your right hand lateral to the outer margin lateral margin of the rectus, always remember while palpating any deep structure, you cannot go through a strong muscle. So your hand should be outside. So outside the rectus muscle in the right iliac fossa, your tip of the fingers towards the left axilla and filling the inferior margin of the liver with the outer and edge of these fingers. And after that, with the synchronization of the inspiration, gradually you go upwards and try to fill the inferior margin of the liver, always keeping your hand outside the rectus. And once you have gone up to the uh, costal margin and you haven't yet felt the liver, you should always remember to go to the other side to fill for the left uh, lobe of the liver. In case you get an enlarged liver, you are supposed to do palpation of the surface of the liver and also percussion of the chest to see the upper border of the liver to see how enlarged it is. And after that, the third phase and phase of skills you should master is redressing the patient, cover him up properly and then thank him for the uh, cooperation.